Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you are all doing well. So I just got ready for the day and I thought, why not do a vlog, a weekly vlog? I'm back home now. I got back from skiing on Sunday. It is now Tuesday and we had the best time. We literally, it was a holiday I needed. I fully reset everything and I am ready to go and attack life. Um, honestly, yesterday I walked I walked in on Sunday evening to my apartment and like the sun was setting and I was like, my God, it feels like summer. It feels like summer. There was the sun coming in through my balcony and I was just like, wow. And then yesterday morning I got up and I thought, I'm just so happy to be alive. Like, do you ever just get that feeling where you're just like, I'm just so happy to be here. So anyway, I'm feeling really positive after the ski trip. Don't know what the what they're serving in the drinks on the in the Alps in France, but something has got me mood boosted. Um, but yeah, I that's just a little week of the vlog. I've gotten ready. I am about to go to Social PR, who I'm on management, to see them at the office. They've actually got a new office. So I've been, but I don't know if I've ever took you to the old office. But anyway, they're in the Manchester City Centre now, which is great. I'm gonna go in for a catch up. Tell them all about how I spent half the week on the mountain on my ass. If you've seen my legs, I was going to wear a dress today in like a long coat. No. They are black and blue, my legs. Genuinely look like, I don't know, a collage of black and blue paintings on my legs. So that's not cute. I don't know what I'm going to say in this video. I might just do it in the weekly vlog. Or let's do a separate video for it. But we have got three weeks until my brand launches. I am, um, I'm so scared, I'm so excited, and I think that's probably part of the thing, before I went skiing I was down, I was really down, but I think it's sort of stress, and I don't deal very well with stress. We are launched on the 27th of April, I can't believe it's here, I can't believe it's finally here, I'm stressed, I'm stressed, I'm stressed, but I'm happy, it's a good stress, I'm happy stressed, I'm excited stressed, I'm nervous stressed, I'm everything in between but it's gonna be amazing so i'm gonna go see social pr we're gonna have a little meeting with them about the brand and then yeah i spent the whole morning unpacking my suitcases because i couldn't face them on sunday or yesterday my apartment was a tip looked like a bomb had hit it. um so yeah i've tidied up all there i know i can actually show you because you'll all want to see this so i have painters coming tomorrow to paint my living room because it, my mum and dad came and put my paintings up when I wasn't here and they're a little bit too high. So we had to take them down and I've got red markers with my paintings. However, my sideboard finally came. This is the new sideboard. I actually got this mirror here to go above, but last night my friends seemed to think that I should keep the gold one um, because I feel like it does actually tie everything in together. But I got new little accessories for on here. Best thing ever, way to keep the keys. I've not lost them since, which is amazing. And this was actually my Christmas present from my brother. How nice is that? It got me the crystal bear bricks, which is just unbelievable. It's so heavy. So it needed its own little place. But yeah, how cute does this look now? We're getting there. We are getting there. My old table is there. I'm giving it to my cleaner. She wanted it, so she's gonna have the table and the lamp. I actually need to take them to today. But yeah. It feels so much better in here already. Like, that is so nice. And the, the cabinet is just from Wayfair. So, yeah, it took ages to come, but it's finally here, and I am so happy with it. Let me know if you think I should put that mirror up. But the girls seem to think keep that one, or do I put that one up? Right, so you know how they say things happen in threes? I literally just said to you that I've not lost my keys. First thing, I've just plugged my camera in because it's dead on charge and then when I came to get it to leave, the don't switch the plug on. Then I walked out of my apartment with a bottle of sparkling water underneath my arm. I got to my lift and realised I'm wet through. I'd not shut the lid. So I've then run back into my apartment to dry off with a hairdryer, left my apartment, gone down into the basement where my car is and I was like, oh my God, where are my car keys? With my fob on. So then I had to like dial my concierge, love Ricky, I always say he's an absolute legend. And I was like, Ricky, I've locked myself out. So I've had to go get a new key, go up in the apartment and let myself in and get my keys. So that happens in three, comes in threes. It came thick and fast then. <sighs> but anyway, I walked down to the garage, the, the car park, and it just smelt of summer. Guys, summer is here. 
I'm sorry, but it's, it's 13 degrees today in Manchester. Might as well be 22. People walking around in vests. It's Manchester for you, that. Fucking love it. This is the office at Social PR. How nice is it up here? Wow, I've never been up here before. So nice. And back with Kiana. Back. I've actually missed her so much. I've missed you too. It's I think like YouTube has missed you too. Oh. I've honestly, it's been too long. Too long. We I should be in Barcelona. Right that was so weird. <laughs> it feels like we're in Barcelona. Again on the rooftop. Doesn't this feel like the rooftop? Yeah. Before? It is Barcelona. Yeah. We don't need to go to Barcelona. We've got Manchester. I'm gonna take some pictures for my brand. <laughs> oh, exactly. Yeah, we've just come up here to have a catch up because we haven't seen each other in a minute. I know. We've so we need to fill much. each other in on things that everyone can know about downstairs. <laughs> <laughs> Anything. I feel like I'm looking at you on the camera. <laughs> the camera. I don't want to flash that. Do you want to sing? Scott just said, Do you want uh, to sing you a song? Okay. Sing me a song. Round the night. Woo! Has come. <laughs> and the land is dark. And the moon. Like I said, oh my. Wow! <laughs> and there was a bird that was appeared acting behind you as you then, started singing. Like that. If, I don't make, if I don't get tagged in this video. <laughs> Levels. Uh, levels. They, all clap. they don't normally clap when I walk in. <laughs> this is oh, the office though. The that was a really office. nice the way, social thing. Right, Mary, I was saying to the girls, yeah. Do you want this on YouTube? Yeah, this is on okay. YouTube. Right, so I was saying that we should have an S here. Yeah. yeah. Giant S, a P here, and then like the R, because it's like three things for the logo. Yeah. And they were having it. Don't think it will block a lot of light. Nah, they, they were saying tacky. aesthetically it was tacky. And from back, from outside it'll be backwards. Exactly. So you'll look like P, you look like r rips, rips. So what do you think just that then in the middle there? I, will, I don't think you need anything on the window. I think it looks nice here. Looks really, so, I like the colour of the wall too. It's a really nice colour. No, what we do need, we need some pictures of our talent as well now, like classy ones. Pictures um, of me in yeah, every like, single square. Black, black, <laughs> black and white ones. <laughs> Fuck that. that. Cool, I right? need to go there. Oh, right. What? Yeah, you just don't like anything, yeah. Yeah, but it's minimal. Why are you going to put this? Right, what about on this wall here? Yeah, a nice what, picture of Mary. I can't believe that's not me. On that, black, that thing. Black, what about nice little, like, small ones, like a little black and white of all time? That'd be sick. Yeah, very wobbly. But, just got back home from meeting social PR and sat on my sofa around my friend Corey and she was like, Mary, wait. At a bar near mine. So I was like, well, if the sun is out. So I'm gonna go meet them, just put like a comfy top on. This top as well is actually like a big enough to be a dress. I really wish I wasn't wonky one minute. There, that's better. And um, this top, if you can see, I put it a bit high. Um, I got loads of bits from Milani, Milani, I think it is. Milana, 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 M I L N. M I L A N A Studios, I think it's called. And I got a tracksuit to go um, skiing in. And Tara, who owns it, is my friend, put a few more bits in. And literally, I'm obsessed. Like, I really wish I could show you this right now. The t shirts are so oversized. I've tucked mine in the bottom because I actually asked for like really big sizes so that I could wear them as dresses. But I just put it on with some jeans now, and they're just so nice. Like, Look really nice t-shirts just have on especially like coming into summer you now I think it's gonna get a bit hotter to wear this like with like as a dress and then some trainers I feel like it's really cute so yeah I just put my Lara leather jacket on which I actually don't want to wear anymore because I see TikToks about everyone wearing this jacket but I actually got my jacket last year the last time it came out I've had it for like it's over a year old now but like there's so many TikToks about people wearing this jacket, like the Zara jacket. So every time I wear it, I feel self-conscious. People judging me. But fuck it, I'm off to have a drink with my friends. Mitch is there. I'm gonna bring you. But my camera's, oh, it's charged. And also what else happened to me, which is the day's just going great. Them three things came fast and hard. If three things are gonna happen to you, it's better just go bang, bang, bang. It's done then. You only ever come in threes. Um, went to PR, walked back to my car, and my, t my parking must have run out because where I parked, you could only park for two hours, which is a bit stupid really. Like, I don't know why they only do two hours in town. 
because people are obviously longer than two hours. Like three would be perfect. Anyway, I was walking back to the, tra the traffic ward and was stood there at my car and I was like, oh no. I've not had a ticket in quite a while now. I've really, really learned my lesson on that one. So anyway, I was like, oh. And then I flashed my car and he looked and I was like, have I run out of time? Because I bet it was only about 15 minutes. Like it wasn't that long. I wasn't in social PR for the longest time. And he was like, I'll let you off. And I was like, that's what I love to see. He was obviously in a summer mood too. You know what? When the sun's out, everyone's in a good mood. Even parking wardens, what are they, what are they called? Ticket wardens. He was in a great mood. So now I'm in a great mood. And that causes for a drink of celebration. Not a drink drink. I'm not going to get steaming. But I'm just going to have one in the sun with my friends. Pass me your lip gloss. I'm just gonna put a wee bit of chat. Stick on. <laughs> What's this? What's this? What's this? What's this chat? So you can buy this on Made by Mitchell forward slash bleem, beam, bleem, 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 beam. This is a point to Albert. It's not even, not even. You don't want to announce the name of it because I haven't even. Tell her. Yeah. So this is Shade Prinny. Yeah. From, bleep this out. From. Thank three, two, one. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers Cheers. 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 Cheers to Ned! Cheers! Good morning, people. <sighs> I've just woken up. One drink last night turned into five. It wasn't a drug one, though. It was just, we just went to two bars. Was home for 12 o'clock. Really wasn't anything major. Um, but yeah, got up today. And the weather's shit. Just looked out of my windows and it's shit. Summer's gone. I thought it was summer to stay. But oh well, we've got a good day ahead of us. We're gonna go boxing. We've started boxing. <laughs> the you do. I'm actually really good at it as well. Like I'm not even joking. I'm really good. I think it's because I've got such strong punch that Chantel's like, Mary, you're really good at this. Chantel's my boxing coach, also friend. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go there. I really enjoy going box on a Wednesday morning. Then I have a facial and I'm a bit of in two minds about it because now at the minute I have been having a hydrofacial because I'm obsessed with them, been having them for ages, but hydrofacial. And then two weeks later having microneedling done and then two weeks later hydrofacial, like doing the alternate thing. So once I'm, I have one each a month, Anyway, today's the day of the microneedling. Oh my god, I've got something in my eye. Is that anyway? Today is the day of the microneedling at two o'clock. I completely forgot, but I got the podcast at three. And when you have a microneedling done, your face is like bright red for the whole day. And do I really want to be walking around Manchester City with a bright red face? I think not. But then I do love getting the facial done. So I'm in two minds about that. Gonna see how I feel a little bit later on, but I'm just gonna make a coffee now. I actually ran out of my favourite coffee yesterday and I've forgotten to buy it again. So I'm gonna have to use one that I don't really like. Sad times. I usually use this one, but there are, I've run out of that, so I'm gonna use this one. Also, I don't know if you can see up there, but since the last time on YouTube, I've organised all my cupboards in my kitchen. <laughs> really, really good. I recommend to everyone to do it. I got like um, these little trays for all in every single cupboard. And it's just made everything so much more organised. So much easier to access. Like I've got them in every single cupboard in my apartment. And it's just sorted my life out. So I just got them from, I think I went to the range and got them. So I really recommend for anyone, if you want to be an organized queen, 
to do that because it was one of the best decisions I've made. Jim, Chantel's running away. <laughs> I'm absolutely flowing because she made me start on this. I hate this. It might as well be called the devil. If you know, you know with this bike. It's just not nice. But we're gonna do some boxing and then she's gonna make me do circuits to finish. So I'm trying to get my way out of but I can't get out of it. But today's one of them days where I've got my timings completely wrong. <sighs> the podcast is going on. Oh. Sorry. So embarrassing. Someone just tried to get, like, when got, got in the lift and I was filming, I was like, oh, put my camera down. I just was vlogging in the I'm lift nice. and I'm look at the state of me. I've just been vlogging in the someone lift and someone got in, got in and it's never happened to me before. I was I, so embarrassed. That happened like, to me when I really needed to do a boo man pitch. Ellie's hair. Mm. I fell asleep with wet hair, so. You don't look bad though. Do I think you look really fresh. She is. Yeah. Ellie just said I smell nice, but I don't know how because my hands stunk from the boxing gloves. So I washed them about 20 times. <laughs> I didn't have time to have a shower, so. And my face has been moved to three. So I can make everything oh, I have work. A yeah. Look at this. I need one. Look at that. And oh, so that was like me. So I've seen exact that same place. So yeah, we're going to record the podcast. Blonde Diaries, everybody. Got it right. Blonde Diaries. Right, Red. So I finally made it to the facial. I'm 20 minutes late, but I'm here. We're gonna have the mic. What's it called? Micro pen. Skin pen. Skin pen. <laughs> pen. <laughs> so I'm gonna be bright red after this. But when I had it done last time, it was the best thing. My skin went so clear after we had it done last time. So I can't wait to have this done. This is what I look like straight from my facial. I feel like you really can't even see how bad it is. But you can see I am literally bright red. I look like a fallen asleep in the sun with goggles on for three days. But it is so good. Honestly, I had one the other week and my I was like, I've got a bit of scarring on my face. Like on here from like when I had got some spots around Christmas time and they just won't go in. And genuinely my face, after it goes, it'll be gone down by tonight and then tomorrow like you just use the products that they give you on your face. And then honestly, my skin was the best it's ever been, like ever. And then I went to Milan and Pippa was just like to me, Mary, like your face just looks so nice, my skin. This isn't paid for or anything. Like I pay for these, I pay for the facials. Every two weeks I have a facial. But I just think it's such a good thing to spend my money on. Like if you are gonna invest in something, I was speaking to the girl about it today molly who does my facial i was like this year i really want to be like self-love whatever and getting a facial and having there's nothing better than good skin when you're coming into summer especially because i don't wear makeup day to day really unless i'm doing something like taking pictures or whatever i don't wear any makeup so when your skin is just good you just feel like a different person so even though i look like an alien right now by tomorrow well, tomorrow it probably might be a little bit red still, but then the day after that, your skin's just so good. I mean, it's burning quite a lot right now. 
it's like a it's like a needling pen so it doesn't hurt like it hurts a little bit it hurts where your face is bony so it really hurts me on my jaw and it hurts me on my forehead but then here because i've got fat um it doesn't hurt there but yeah this is what i look like can't believe i come on camera and actually look like this i no wonder i'm single she had a bit too much but oh well this is what i look like so now i'm gonna go home um, I think Kate might come round tonight. I'm actually really hungry because I've not had a chance to have lunch yet because I've been running around like a blue ass fly all afternoon. It's now four o'clock, so I'm gonna go have some lunch, late lunch, and then cook some tea for tonight. When I when I have sam, I don't know whether to have tonight. I was thinking about it just sending my facial salmon couscous and broccoli and green beans, or to have tuna pasta with broccoli and green beans so i'm not sure what i'm feeling do i want couscous and salmon or do i want pasta and tuna good morning guys so my face has gone down obviously a lot as you can see but i have still got some marks this morning um which wasn't a last time when i had it done when i woke up in the morning the marks was all fully gone but apparently molly said she did it higher yesterday but my skin is being so soft my cleaner is here, Misha, which is the vacuum you can hear, and the painters are here today painting this room. So let me see if I can show you. All of my belongings are all in the middle of the room right now. But hopefully these walls are gonna get painted because like look at the marks where the mirror's been. The radiator basically is like putting dust up my wall. So they all just need repainting, the holes need filling in. And then yeah, as the paintwork is done, I completely forgot to show you all. However, I'll show you in the morning when it's light, but look how much nicer it looks. And Sophie's here. Hey! She's all just the Nando's. What did you get? Um, I got a wrap up. <laughs> it's not in there. Oh yeah. Oh, I would have been ill with that. I got a butterfly chicken, spicy rice. I got chips. And broccoli. And mash. Spicy rice. Broccoli is so dead. No, it's not. It's nice. You're meant to encourage broccoli and PT. But they got what did you get? Chips and, and mash. mash. They've got no and a wrap. Because <laughs> I'm out. Be better, yeah. <laughs> She's going to out Sophie Cresswell. The she tells us all to be veg, but she eats nothing but carbs. No, there's no season on that broccoli. It's like water. Well, Sophie, some of us are on a diet. <laughs> That's great. Someone messaged That's Sophie cool. earlier saying, um, whatever you do to look like you, I just want your body. I said, I wish people said that to me. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm touching that. Have you got any perineus? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Look, look I've got have... broccoli in the <laughs> fridge. No, you don't. I do, sir? No, I meant your perineus. I do, sir. To be fair, I've got some mayo. Perinase mild for the mild queen. And then I'm just going to put some of this spicy rice on here. Can we sit on the couch or not? Yeah. Be careful though. <laughs> I shouted at Sophie the other week. <laughs> because, oh, look at the state of me. I felt my face getting redder. We got, I got a new rug because my rug was ruined. So I got the same one again, but just a new one, fresh. And so I was like, no one is eating food <laughs> on the, there anymore because it was ruined with food. So then anyway, so obviously it's down next to me and she spills a pasta on the floor. <laughs> so I went, oh, Sophie, you're taking the piss now. She went, Mary, don't ever disrespect me again. Because she went to me. Oh, Sophie, taking the piss now, as if I took the piss like all day. <laughs> she went, don't ever disrespect me like that. I never take the piss, and it was so awkward. I was just like, <laughs> and we, Ellie was sat there, and we were all just sat there like. I was like, I haven't done anything wrong. But it was an accident, like I did it on purpose. She shouted at me like I actually. I was like, I told everyone not to eat on this mat. She shouted at me like I literally got my plate <laughs> and went like that. Ha 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 ha. When it was actually an accident, I was like, what? So yeah, <laughs> we do argue. I'm joking. We never argue, do no, we? No, no. We actually never argue, me and you. No, we actually Sometimes. never. <laughs> we just bicker like sisters. We are like sisters. That's why yeah. we don't bicker. I don't think we bicker. No, we don't actually. We never, we never bicker. We just ring each other crying. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
and what they do. Okay. What do I say? <laughs> you always say, Mary, it's fine. Everything will always blow over. It will. That's something in life that I've really learned. Everything works out. Everything will work out. And one thing that I'm bringing into my life at the minute is like, there's no point in stressing about things twice. This is what Cora said to me the other day. She said, if you stress about something, and you're, there's no point in stressing about it again, like it's happened now. Yeah, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, oh, it's happening, so there's nothing you can do about yeah. it. Yeah. So you've just got to think everything will work out by the end, and it always does. You well, can't stress about things that you can't control. Yeah. You've just got to let things be. Mmm. That's like a lemon on it. That's a first. Mama tastes, like, like, tastes like assholes. <laughs> We're currently watching the Lewis Capaldi documentary because we love Lewis. I heart Lewis. I actually met Lewis Capaldi in Ocean Beach. I know Mary actually told me she met him at Ocean Beach. I did. I've got a video of him on my phone speaking to my ex-boyfriend because I was so in love with my ex-boyfriend. I met Lewis Capaldi and asked him to send a video. After five hours of getting steaming together because we was on the same table, like it wasn't like I just went up to him and was like, can I have a video? We was actually pissed together because we ended up being on the same table at Ocean Beach. And then I was like, after five hours, do you mind seeing my boyfriend um, a video? Because <laughs> he was like not there. And now I've got one picture of Louis Quality of me and him, but a, a like two minute video over to my ex boyfriend. Can't <laughs> use that for nothing. I know. Please. Another day, please. It's a nightfall. And you're not here to get me through it all. I let my guard down. And then you put a rise. I was scared it kind of used to be. Mary told me someone that she you. <laughs> Love to Mary, black screen. Mary told us that she can sing like a dad. I can't remember I sing it out. And she videos herself <laughs> and then records it and listens to it back. <laughs> <laughs> no, do you know what's so funny about that? Sophie said to us two days ago, I oh my god. I used to, someone said in the group, I used to video myself when I was younger and play it back myself and I still do that. <laughs> Are you on joking? You wasn't joking. I used to do it when I was young, I used to do it on voice record. I actually think I sound good in the shower, then I was to check back and I think, wow. I do sound good. You sound like a cat crying. <laughs> <laughs> Louise, if you want some backing singers, so make this. No, what the hell is that? Where the gals? Got you, Louis. Good morning, everybody. Um, it is Good Friday today. Happy Easter to anyone watching this. I'm gonna go out to Leeds today, but this is gonna be the last day of my vlog, last morning of my vlog. Um, so I'm just gonna show you the apartment. Now it's painted. This has been asked so much, and I can finally show you it now. The finished result from if you was here a few, probably months ago now, when I decided to up and change everything in my apartment. So yeah, it's finished. So the kitchen. Well, how can I show you this? It's such a lovely day today outside. This is the sofa area. Obviously, as you've seen, I got a new rug. This is the same table as before, but I just changed all the decorations on it. So this is from Amazon, HomeSense, H&M, the tray I've had from Amazon for a while. They're from Amara, I think. This is the candle putter out that my mum and dad got me from Dior for Christmas. And then again, the book was just from Amazon. So this is my little sofa area. Um, this is looking this way, but nothing's changed here. You can probably all remember from when I first moved in, I've had that. And then the bar stools are here. I don't know if I've showed you them actually on YouTube yet, but these are my new bar stools. And literally they just make everything so much lighter. Um, then I wanted a really big moss ball, but I couldn't find one. So I actually made this moss ball. So I got this ball off Wayfair, and then I got the, um, the balls off Amazon and just put them in with some pebbles underneath. And I think it looks pretty good if I do say so myself. The kitchen. And if you turn around, this is the nice dining area place now. So I've still got the same chairs. I think you've seen that mirror already. Um, I got this vase from Zara Home and then just put these like fake flowers in, but I think they look quite real to be fair. And then this is my little corner here. There's, again, nothing's really changed that much. Got a new plant that you've seen already though. All this stuff is just from H&M. And then my new artwork. So this is what it finally looks like. It's really hard to do this. That's my new artwork and then 
have it again up there. So this is the finished kitchen and lounge area. Where I got my paintings from, he is called Bijron on Instagram and he's literally amazing. He did my last one there that said, I love you. And then I just asked him for obviously for something more cream and neutral. But yeah, this is it. And then if we go into the hallway, I don't know why I always sing my words. My dad always asks me that. Hi, me. So this is the new sideboard. I think I showed you it already though, Anna. Um, I'll just do it as a full tour. Again, the mirror is from Wayfair. I don't know if I said this already. Um, this lamp is from the White Company, H&M. H&M for my keys. This is the same book I've got in the lounge. I just bought another one off Amazon. And then H&M. So yeah, now you can see my hallway going into my kitchen living room is a lot more neutral and just like a really zen calming space so yeah guys i am gonna end this vlog here i am about to go back to leeds to see my family for the weekend because it's easter go to church all the rest of it that you do thank you so much for watching this video and i will see you on my next one bye guys